Sarah says, who would ask the questions in the grave? And what are those questions? Is it true that our good deeds and recitation of the Quran would transform into beautiful looking man who would be present during questioning in the grave? As for the first question, we know from authentic hadith that two angels who look horrible and who are so tough in their questioning would come to an individual, whether Muslim or non-Muslim. And they will ask him three or four questions. So they will reprimand the deceased in his grave and they will shout at him, who's your Lord? A believer would say, Allah. What's your religion? A believer would say, Islam. Who is this man who was sent to you? And he would reply, he's Muhammad, the messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And then they would ask him, what did you do or what have you done in what you have received from this message or information? And he would say, I believed in the book of Allah, the Quran, and I acted upon it. Then they will say to him, sleep like a bride until the day of judgment. And then a gate or a window from paradise would be open in his grave and he will get some of the fragrances and the coolness and the beautiful things in it. And he will say, oh Allah, make the hour be cold now. I want day of judgment now so that I would be admitted to my paradise. Then the Prophet tells us a man who's well presented will come to him and the deceased would say, MashaAllah, your face is, is very beautiful. You're a handsome person and I feel comfortable looking at you. Who are you? And the man would say, I am your good deeds. And this is an authentic hadith. The disbeliever and the hypocrite, when they were asked, when they are asked about these four or three things, they would say, huh? Um, I don't know. I heard people say, and I said what they had said. So they will be shouted at, and these two angels would hit the man on his head with a big stick, mirzabba, something that is scary, and he would turn into salt. And then he would be brought back again, and they will punish him and open a window from hell, and he would be punished in his grave until the day of judgment, while calling, oh Allah, let the day of judgment never come, because if this is in the grave, what will happen when the day of judgment comes? May Allah Azza wa Jal protect us all.